God came in and you can feel when he was touching your mind. Come on, somebody. When you couldn't sleep at night because you was inundated with problems and situations. But then the spirit of the Lord will walk in your room and tell you everything's going to be all right. See, that's the type of God that we serve. If it had not been the Lord that was on our side. And the Bible says this in Psalm 61 and 1. Hear my cry, O Lord. Attend to my prayer. From the end of the earth will I cry unto thee. When my heart is overwhelmed, lead me to the rock that is higher than I. For thou has been a shelter for me and a strong tower from the enemy. Look, sometimes situations will tell you to walk off from it. And you know what? I got a real good vision of this. You know what? It's sometimes like you see somebody out in the, in the middle of the water. And sometimes all it is is, I can't even think of what this, it's like an anchor. But I, I know it sits up in the water and I can't think of the name of it. And sometimes they have to climb up on it so that, it, that, that the the water does not take them down and they don't drown in the water. That's how it's said. In the midst of the things that's coming your way, the things that seem like it's going to flood you, you got to climb up, y'all. You can't afford to let that thing drown you. But climb up. Where am I going? I'm going to the rock. Who is the rock? The rock is Jesus. And Jesus is my shelter. Jesus is my hiding place. Oh, God, help me here. <laughs> Jesus is our strong tower. He comes to protect us from our enemies. And then Psalms picked it up and said, when thou passest through the water, Lord, help me. I will be with thee and through the rivers. They shall not overflow thee. When thou walkest through the fire, thou shall not be burned and neither shall the flame kindle against thee. But when thou passest through the waters... I'll be with thee. There's no situation that can take you under if you trust in God. Oh, I know that's a strong statement. But yes, I'm saying it because there is no situation that would take you under. God said, I'll be with you. He said, fear not. He always told us, fear not. And you know what you've got to understand? There are some of you, your biggest snare is fear. God help me here. God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of love and of power and of a sound mind. You don't have to fear what the devil can do unto you. Come on. If the devil had that much power, you wouldn't be sitting here tonight. Come on. You would not have made it. You wouldn't have made it. He would have took you out when he could. But the devil don't have that type of power. Come on, when we didn't even have the strength to fight for ourselves, God stepped in the fight. Hallelujah. When we was too tired sometimes just to get down on our knees, but yet God would stand over us and keep the enemy from hitting us from behind. <laughs> if it had not been the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. If it had not been the Lord, who is on our side. But I hear God saying again, the snare is broken. And remember when they went into the Red Sea, passed over the Red Sea, the Lord spoke to them and said, these Egyptians that you see, you will see no more. Y'all, the Holy Ghost is saying tonight, it's some Egyptians in your life huh, that you're not going to see no more. There's some people that sit here that you're just tired of not having money. But I'm telling you, the snare is broken. If you are a tie pair, you can demand increase. I know y'all don't believe that. I can demand, you can demand increase. You can demand increase when you're a tie pair. Whatever you ask in the name of Jesus. He said, if you are bound in me and my words are bound in you. You can ask what you will. He said, and it shall be done. Egyptians, Egyptians, poverty Egyptians, sickness Egyptians. Come on, you all. The enemy is trying to put all type of sickness on the people of God. And you know it's the enemy because when you get to the doctor, all we end up doing is paying all this money. And all your tests come back positive. 
or negative. And they don't know what's wrong with you. It ain't nothing from but the devil. Let me tell y'all something. The devil majors in symptoms. Y'all looking at me. That's his major. His major is symptoms. But how many know God specializes in healing? I'll take the specialist any day. Come on, the Bible says that we are healed by, the, his, stri by his stripes. We are healed. And I like the saints when they sing that I'm healed by the wound in his side. I know we don't sing that no more. But we've got to start walking in our healing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But you don't know, I, you know, I, cancer run in my family and, and, and sugar run in my family. I don't care what run in your family. Whew, I know that's strong. But how about the blood of Jesus? Come on, somebody. I know with my natural mind, I know my mother might have died of a heart attack. But I plead the blood over my life. I stand on the power of the blood. Help us shut up. Don't care what no devil say. Some of us are too scared to even really get into ministry because you say, well, you know, my body, you know, it, it just be so achy and it, I don't know what's going on. And the devil done told half of the folk in here, y'all going to die. Help me, Holy Ghost. But you know what? The power of life and death lies in the tongue. And when the devil say, you're going to die, you know what you got to tell him? I rebuke premature death. I'm not going nowhere till God tell me it's time to go. Oh, I know y'all don't believe it. Why can I stand like that? Because if it had not been the Lord that's on my side. Oh, God, help me here. Help me here. Lord, help me. The devil can't take us out, y'all. These Egyptians that you see, you will see no more. I, I don't know what you're going through, but I hear that. I hear that so strong. Stop worrying about them. Because they're gone, y'all. But since Chuck, but they're gone. But, but, but they're gone. The Holy Ghost said, the snare is broken. Hey. See, that's what's wrong. You know what? Sometimes we didn't get to the place. We can't praise God till we see it. We can't praise God till we feel it. But if God said it, that settles it. I don't go with this thing about hey, God said it, I believe it. No, God said it whether you believe it or not. That still settles it because God said it. God help me to quit. Mm. Then it says, then it says, Woo, hallelujah. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Who made heaven and earth. And the Bible says. In Psalms. Isaiah 42 and 8. I am the Lord. See I told y'all I like it when he decree who he is. I am the Lord. That is my name. And my glory. Will I, will I not give to another. Neither my praise. To graven in, in images. Then in Acts 4 and 12. Neither is there salvation. Lord, help me here.